In statistics, Spearman's rank correlation coefficient or Spearman's row, named after Charles Spearman and often denoted by the Greek letter or as, is a non-parametric measure of statistical dependence between two variables. It assesses how well the relationship between two variables can be described using a monotonic function. If there are no repeated data values, a perfect Spearman correlation of plus one or a one occurs when each of the variables is a perfect monotone function of the other. Spearman's coefficient, like any correlation calculation, is appropriate for both continuous and discrete variables, including ordinal variables. Definition and calculation The Spearman correlation coefficient is defined as the Pearson correlation coefficient between the rank variables. For a sample of size n, the n raw scores are converted to ranks, and i is computed from. Where is the difference between ranks? See the example below. Identical values are assigned a rank equal to the average of their positions in the ascending order of the values. In the table below, notice how the rank of values that are the same is the mean of what their ranks would otherwise be, in applications where duplicate values are known to be absent, a simpler procedure can be used to calculate i. Note that this method should not be used in cases where the data set is truncated. That is, when the Spearman correlation coefficient is desired for the top X records, the user should use the Pearson correlation coefficient formula given above. The standard error of the coefficient was determined by Pearson in 1907 and Gossett in 1920. It is related quantities. There are several other numerical measures that quantify the extent of statistical dependence between pairs of observations. The most common of these is the Pearson product moment correlation coefficient, which is a similar correlation method to Spearman's rank, that measures the a euro or linear a euro relationships between the raw numbers rather than between their ranks. An alternative name for the Spearman rank correlation is the a euro or e grade correlation a euro. In this, the a euro or rank a euro of an observation is replaced by the a euro or e grade a euro. In continuous distributions, the grade of an observation is, by convention, always one half less than the rank, and hence the grade and rank correlations are the same in this case. More generally, the a euro or e grade a euro of an observation is proportional to an estimate of the fraction of a population less than a given value, with the half observation adjustment at observed values. Thus this corresponds to one possible treatment of tied ranks. While unusual, the term a euro or e grade correlation a euro is still in use. Interpretation The sign of the Spearman correlation indicates the direction of association between x and y. If y tends to increase when x increases, the Spearman correlation coefficient is positive. If y tends to decrease when x increases, the Spearman correlation coefficient is negative. A Spearman correlation of zero indicates that there is no tendency for y to either increase or decrease when x increases. The Spearman correlation increases in magnitude as x and y become closer to being perfect monotone functions of each other. When x and y are perfectly monotonically related, the Spearman correlation coefficient becomes 1. A perfect monotone increasing relationship implies that for any two pairs of data values xi, a y and x j, that xia a and xj and a r a and always have the same sign. A perfect monotone decreasing relationship implies that these differences always have opposite signs. The Spearman correlation coefficient is often described as being non-parametric. This can have two meanings. First, the fact that a perfect Spearman correlation results when x and y are related by any monotonic function can be contrasted with the Pearson correlation which only gives a perfect value when x and y are related by a linear function. The other sense in which the Spearman correlation is non-parametric in that its exact sampling distribution can be obtained without requiring knowledge of the joint probability distribution of x and y, example, in this example, the raw data in the table below is used to calculate the correlation between the IQ of and with the number of hours spent in front of TV per week. Firstly, evaluate. To do so use the following steps, reflected in the table below. Sort the data by the first column. Create a new column and assign it the ranked values 1, 2, 3, n. 
Next, sort the data by the second column. Create a fourth column and similarly assign it the ranked values 1, 2, 3, n. Create a fifth column to hold the differences between the two rank columns. Create one final column to hold the value of column squared. With found, add them to find. The value of n is 10. These values can now be substituted back into the equation at a give. Which evaluates to i a equals a minus 29 165 equals a a 0 0.17575757575. With a p-value equal 0 0.627188, this low value showed that the correlation between IQ and hours spent watching TV is very low, although the negative value suggests that the longer the time spent watching television the lower the IQ. In the case of ties and the original values, this formula should not be used. Instead, the Pearson correlation coefficient should be calculated on the ranks. Determining significance one approach to test whether an observed value of i is significantly different from zero is to calculate the probability that it would be greater than or equal to the observed r, given the null hypothesis, by using a permutation test. An advantage of this approach is that it automatically takes into account the number of tied data values there are in the sample, and the way they are treated in computing the rank correlation. Another approach parallels the use of the Fisher transformation in the case of the Pearson product moment correlation coefficient. That is, confidence intervals and hypothesis tests relating to the population value Y can be carried out using the Fisher transformation. If F, R, is the Fisher transformation of R, the sample Spearman rank correlation coefficient, and N is the sample size, then is a Z score for a which approximately follows a standard normal distribution under the null hypothesis of statistical independence. One can also test for significance using which is distributed approximately as student's t distribution with null a a 2 degrees of freedom under the null hypothesis. A justification for this result relies on a permutation argument. A generalization of the Spearman coefficient is useful in the situation where there are three or more conditions, a number of subjects are all observed in each of them, and it is predicted that the observations will have a particular order. For example, a number of subjects might each be given three trials at the same task, and it is predicted that performance will improve from trial to trial. A test of the significance of the trend between conditions in this situation was developed by E. B. Page and is usually referred to as Page's trend test for ordered alternatives. Correspondence analysis based on Spearman's row, classic correspondence analysis is a statistical method that gives a score to every value of two nominal variables. In this way the Pearson correlation coefficient between them is maximized. There exists an equivalent of this method called grade correspondence analysis, which maximizes Spearman's row or Kendall's tau. See also Kendall tau rank correlation coefficient, Chebyshev sum inequality, rearrangement inequality, references. Further reading, Corder G. W., Foreman D. I. Nonparametric statistics for non-statisticians, a step-by-step -step approach. Hoboken, New Jersey Wiley. ISBN A 978-0-470-4546-19 OCLC A 276228975 A, Spearman C. The Proof and Measurement of Association Between Two Things. AMA. J. Cycol 15, 72 a Euro 101 DOI. 10.2307 slash 1412159R, Bonet DG, Wright, TA. Sample size requirements for Pearson, Kendall, and Spearman correlations. Psychometrica 65, 23 Euro 28 a, Kendall MG. Rank correlation methods. London, Griffin. ISBN A978-0-852. 6419-96. OCLCA 136868A, Hollander M., Wolf Dar. Nonparametric Statistical Methods. New York, Wiley. ISBN A 978 0 471 40635 8. 
OCLC A520735 A, Caruso JC, Cliff N. Empirical Size, Coverage, and Power of Confidence Intervals for Spearman's Row. Ed and Psi. Mies 57, 637 A Euro 654 DOI. 10.1177/0013164497050409 external links understanding correlation versus copulas in excel by eric talker technology partners 2011 table of critical values of i for significance with small samples spearman's rank online calculator chapter 3 part 1 shows the formula to be used when there are ties an example of how to calculate Spearman's row along with basic A code. Spearman's rank correlation, simple notes for students with an example of usage by biologists and a spreadsheet for Microsoft Excel for calculating it.